here at the Port Royal Speedway, the green flag is out. The Bob Wecker Memorial underway for night number one. Brett Marks goes to the high side. Marks makes it three wide for the lead momentarily. Oh my, one in the fence, but Marks leads him down the back stretch. Got one off the pace, I believe. TJ Stutz. Or, yes, TJ Stutz. Something broke in the rear of the word over the All-Star Circuit of Champions radios as Stutz rolls into turn number three on the high side. Brent Marks who lead lap number one. Here comes the Wiker 29 of Danny Dietrich. He's already up to second down the back stretch. Here comes Logan Wagner charging at the Wiker livestock 29. Dietrich low, Wagner a high, but as they battle, Brent Marks is pulling away. Dead even, drag race down to the line. Logan Wagner's in second. Logan Wagner, one All-Star win in his career at Lernerville Speedway in 2017, trying to back that up tonight here at his home track of the Port Royal Speedway. They're roping in the top two as we drag race for the lead down the back stretch. Wagner to the lead in turn three, but Dietrich and Larson are right there. Dietrich down low, Marks with the move. He powers outside Logan Wagner. What a tremendous move by the Marstown missile. He'll lead lap number nine, but it's not over yet. Here comes Danny Dietrich. He's looking to the bottom side of Logan Wagner. He's gonna try to bring Kyle Larson as we have two cars getting together in the middle of turns number three and four. Paul McMahon, nowhere to go. Yellow flag is out. Larson has been on an absolute tear. Hasn't finished worse than sixth in his last 31 starts on dirt, and now he'll go after Wagner for second, and he's got him in turn three. Can Kyle Larson get her done here tonight as we have 12 laps in the book? Wagner, he's going to look down the bottom. He's going to leave the top shelf open for young monies. Kyle can't get a lot of momentum together as they're nose to tail. They're side by side right behind him between Aaron Wrights and Danny Dietrich. Here he comes. Can he get the right bite off of four? No, but he switched lanes. He's going to work to the inside of Wagner. Side by side, close quarters right there as Kyle Larson will take second, but he slides high. Logan Wagner drives back by. Logan Wagner not backing down from Kyle. Kyle Larson and Brent Marks, he'd be loving this if he could see it. Marks starting to slip away as we come to halfway this time. Larson to second. Kyle Larson has his sights set on Brent Marks. 1.5 seconds back at halfway. We are about a lap away from your leaders getting into the rear of the field. Larson goes high and bounces off the wall. That's going to cost him just a little bit. He'll mount a charge of Brent Marks down the front stretch. Brent Marks has got company. Larson to the lead. No, it's Brent by Marks by the James Bond, point 007. Larson to the lead in turn number two, and there's Logan Wagner right there. Down the backstretch, they're wing to wing for the top spot. Brent Marks to the inside of Kyle Larson, and a lap car right in front of him. Sweet meat pie, it doesn't get any better than this. Side by side off of four, Kyle Larson. He's gonna lead lap number 20. 10 more laps to go. What does Brent Marks do? He's gonna go up high, but slowly and surely, look at Logan Wagner. He's right there. He's gonna bring the 87 of Aaron Reitzel with him. Off of four, checker flag is out, and Kyle Larson will win night number one of the Bob Weicker Memorial.